Dear Jared, you are everything I didn't know I wanted. God knows me so much better than I know myself, and he proved that by giving me you. You are so patient and calm, and I promise you are going to need that some days with me. You are adventurous and spontaneous, two of my favorite things. You are godly and you are a leader, which are two qualities I couldn't marry you without. You are loving and you show that in so many ways. I never have to ask if you love me because I have never doubted it. Babe, we have waited too long for this day, like two whole months. Just kidding, they flew by and it was awesome. And at the end of the day, I will be Miss Brianna Lauber and I will get to say, that for the rest of our long lives, Jay, you love me better than I ever expected and more than I deserve. You show me unconditional love. I may still have a lot to learn about you, like how you'll handle our first fight. I think I know that one though. Or what kind of vegetables you'll eat. But I know all the important things about you that made me want to spend forever with you. I know that you're loyal, that you make things work, and you're already proven that you won't give up on me. I know that you are my best friend, my soon-to-be husband, and my favorite person in the world. Life is going to be incredible with you. Thank you for pursuing me, praying for me, and for constantly surprising me. I love you, so let's get married. Love, Breezy. I want to love you forever, I do. Bree, I can't believe this day is happening. You have no idea how much I have prayed for today and for how long I have been praying for today. It truly is an example of God's faithfulness that we are getting married. Almost from the moment I met you, I felt God saying that you were my wife. I am so thankful that God came through with that promise. Sometimes it pays off to pray big and possible prayers. When I think about your, our life together, I get so excited that excitement comes from the woman you are. Bree, before I met you, I had these very high expectations of the girl I wanted to marry. She had to love and pursue Christ. She had to be funny and outgoing. I wanted her to love people and be adventurous. I was looking for a beautiful girl who could make my heart skip a beat with just a smile. She had to be smart and good with kids. I thought I was dreaming of a girl that didn't exist, and I met you. Bree, you blew all my expectations out of the water. You are so much better than the girl I dreamed up in my mind. Bree, the way you love me and the way you care for me is so far and above what I deserve. Thank you for loving me. I hope you know you have my full heart. I love you with all that I have, and I promise for the rest of our lives, I will give you all of me. All of my love, all of my heart, and all of my soul. Bree, from today until forever, I am yours. Love, Jared.
Hey, I try my best to talk to you. Tell you about the things I like to do. I know your smile is lighting up the room. Up the room. Do you always look this beautiful? Can I kiss you when the night is through? Because right now it's all I wanna do. Wanna do. Your lipstick left a mark on my cheek. So I keep thinking of you. Tell me what you wanna do. I'll do anything you ask me to. As long as I can spend the day with you, day with you. The lipstick left a mark on my cheek, so I keep thinking of you. Whoa, you wanna do it again? You wanna do it again sometime? Sometimes, if you'll be standing by your door, I'll pick you up at eight. I said, Whoa, oh, you wanna do it again? You wanna do it again
I tried to hide my feelings for her, but I guess according to our friends, it was painfully obvious. The beginning of our relationship was may- way more um, Jared-sided. <laughs> he was always giving little presents or like making little comments that were obviously pointing towards affection towards me. <laughs> I thought I was very smooth with it and hid my feelings well, but I guess not. So I asked her out, boldly, came in, guns a blazing, very confident, and was immediately shot down. <laughs> he was like saying that he was going to be very respectful, but still wanted to pursue me, like he said, and um, that was just like very attractive. Yeah, Don't get me confused. Sure she still shot good. me down again that night. I, I did. I was over two now. <laughs> oh, that's when I told her, well, if it's not me and you're being honest with me there, then I'm going to continue to pursue you until the timing is right. Then my heart just kind of completely changed away from the plan that I or- originally had and completely toward Jared. <laughs> <laughs> it was a good change. Yeah, I like it.